Warahmatullahi Wabarakatuh. Today I'm going to do a pre-record video of on how uh, to transform from your speech outline to uh, speech tag. Alright, uh, let me uh, share you the video. Alright. Okay, so for example, this is actually the, uh, you know, uh, the speech outline I get, uh, I, I think from uh, PowerPoint. Okay, it's about the topic of uh, unhealthy food. All right, so this is actually introduction. So I take it uh, based on part introduction, content, and also conclusion. All right, I just show you the example on how to expand this uh, speech outline because you have to submit both. Yeah, uh, first is speech outline, and uh, second is uh, your speech tag. Okay, you have to uh, submit it separately for sure. Right. Uh, okay, for example, this is actually your uh, <coughs> speech outline. So what you can do is uh, you just type what you uh, want to state, right? Remember, when you do a speech tag, it is, it is different from uh, essay because of you speak and essay is actually you write. So the, the way you actually uh, uh, write your, your speech tag is a bit different because it's a spoken language. All right, okay, let's say uh, usually we start our speech with uh, Assalamualaikum. <coughs> sorry. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. It's actually part of the greeting. All right, we make it bigger. All right. Assalamualaikum. You know, uh, the beauty. All right. And uh, good day to everybody you know, who watch uh, my video, for example, because of. Uh, this is because of uh, we will do uh, online uh, presentation. Okay, usually if we do face to face. You will say like "Salam alaikum" and uh, "Good evening" or "Good morning" or "Good afternoon." But because of you have to do it uh, pre-recorded, yeah, video. So you you have to change it according to the context, right? For this is actually the context of if you want to uh, do a pre-recorded video. Right, assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh, and good day to everybody who watch my video. <coughs> and then you, <coughs> and then you strictly uh, go to the attention getting open, which is, you know, uh, you showing the video of unhealthy food, and then you just uh, strictly ask the audience, okay, do you think the food in the video? Is healthy. Why? Right. So that's it. Okay, this is actually the the attention getting open. Of course, before you ask a question, you show the video. Maybe one to two minutes of video duration, not too long, because of you just want to get attention from the audience who watch our presentation or who watch our speech. All right. <coughs> And then after that, you just uh, list down the preview of your uh, speech. I mean, the content, the essence of your speech. So say, right today, I'm I'm going to give a speech. I told. How, how to prepare, right? I just uh, totally depend on, uh, totally depend on a uh, speech online, yeah? So that's why uh, we have to make a speech online. So will make my life easier. Uh, our, your life easier, you know, when you uh, try to make a speech tag, okay? Because we have a guide, all right? So I just copy and paste. <coughs> But you need to actually uh, elaborate a little bit, okay, especially in content part. Okay, today I'm going to give a speech entitled How to Prepare a Healthy Diet. Okay, full stop. So you say first, so today I'm going to give a speech entitled How to Prepare a Healthy Diet, which Okay, now you put to stop. Now you say uh, first, you need to reduce 
de gente ya saquen más use lot of vegetable and a small sorry small portions of carbs in protein and lastly right uh, Uh, we must boil and grill rather than frying in preparing a good food, a good sorry, a healthy food. This is nice, uh, a good introduction. All right, uh, so <clears throat> you know, if you look at the speech outline, uh, you just uh, give you use number, but in uh, in uh, speech that you have to actually uh, you know uh, write it down. I mean, uh, in the spoken language, you know, first, uh, second, and third. All right, uh, then uh, you just uh, put your uh, transition without. For the audio, I'll explain in detail you uh, each steps. Okay, and then we go to the content. Okay, this is actually the first main point. All right, talk about uh, reduce the intake of sugar, right, and put in citation, okay? Of course, you have a citation, but in a speech, all right, you, don't, you don't need to write it down, but you plan your, uh, uh, which one do you plan to put a, the a citation. All right, for example, <coughs> okay, you said, uh, my first point is we name to reduce the intake of sugar okay full stop and then maybe you can have to put the citation because it needs citation then say according uh, to harrington for example i just created down yeah uh, 2021 <coughs> can give so it can damage the whole system of our body if you uh, take it daily I just create, but that you can have to put your citation. This is how to be, uh, you put say your citation, All right? And then uh, you look at the sub point. So under this point, you have uh, <coughs> a three uh, sub point, and then uh, for each main point, you have three sub point, which is, for example, reduce uh, in the integer. You have don't don't bring sweet drink. You know, less sugar when you cook any food and eat more fruit as an alternative. Okay, so we, we use the first sub point, which is don't drink sweet drink. Okay, you just say to uh, make sure we can reduce the intake of sugar. All right. We must that we don't drink something sugary, right? Okay, and then sometimes it, give me an example. For example, uh, you know, uh, try to avoid drinking, you know, 
uh, like carbonated uh, green right uh, maybe a sweet uh, coffee or tea right or any thing which use excessive amount of sugar right uh, and then uh, you go to the I think uh, this is actually well elaborated because of you have uh, take the sub point and then you you use example right and then we go straightly to the uh, second sub point which is less sugar when you cook any food and then you can say uh, okay, I make it bigger Remember, a speech owner is actually your your uh, your guide. Okay, and then uh, you expand it or you elaborate it in your speech there. Okay, and then you say I uh, sit here. Sorry, less sugar when you cook any food. Okay. Apart from that, so you use uh, you know uh, transition again. Apart from that, you know uh, sugar can. We reduce when you cook any food. We want to put a citation uh, based on, uh, let's say, uh, Jim, you know, a Bowie, you know, uh, maybe Bowie is doctor, we just created, you know, 2020, right? the uh, good amount of sugar should be used in one plate of food is just one one not one plate but one uh, one part of food Yes, just one table spoon of sugar. Okay, we have citation there. So, Bowie 2003 said the good amount of sugar, the good amount of sugar, so no good amount of sugar uh, should be used in one pot of food is just one tablespoon of sugar. Not the good amount, the right, the right, yeah, the right and healthy amount, right? And then uh, I said uh, the next one is uh, eat more fruit as an alternative citation. Okay, you can say for those who maybe live without sugar, you can uh, take or eat uh, more fruit as if um, most of the fruit have mm, natural sugar like uh, uh, sucrose you know uh, and sorry sucrose sorry i don't know how to spell it how, I think sucrose yeah and fructose which give more benefit compared to uh, processed white sugar. Okay, and maybe you want to see this is something the research done by somebody, so you just put uh, the name of the author, right? Harrington, for example. In 2019, and then said this is actually a uh, direct quotation, so P145. Uh, okay, full stop. Okay, and then you just and then you continue with the second main point and then third point. Board. Remember, okay, to include all the sub point that you have uh, planned, and for each sub point, you must elaborate uh, by giving example or describe, or maybe you in, you attach the citation, it can be considered as. 
uh, the example and, and elaboration, which is, I think, uh, good for you. Yeah. So this is actually an example of how you can uh, elaborate your uh, speech outline for each main point. And then uh, after that, you just uh, move to transition after you finish uh, the 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 uh, the last point, which is sub, uh, sub point C. Yeah. So you said, uh, maybe you can say all in all. Decrease the amount of sugar to make sure we can prepare a healthy. Right, and then you just say uh, because of I I uh, refer to the transition number two right now. So now. We move to the next point. Eating a lot of vegetables and all portion of carbs in proteins in stop. So this is actually a complete of a content, uh, sorry, the body of your AC. And then you can continue with the second main point and third main point. Okay, take a look at the uh, conclusion, yeah? Example of conclusion. Here we have here. Okay, example, you can say, you can just simply say in conclusion, okay, in conclusion, are yeah, I can or make a bigger font. Yeah, there are <coughs> three steps to prepare multi proof. Are and then you just uh, repeat what you say in preview. So, uh, which are reducing the uh, intake of sugar using a lot of vegetables and small portion of carbs and protein and last and last uh, but not least you uh, by using boiling, steaming, and grilling way of cook. You know, sometimes you have to add some weight because of you want to clarify uh, some of the word. You know that maybe cannot be uh, explained in the speech online. Uh, way of cooking rather than You just uh, copy paste from the uh, speech outline and expand it a little bit. And then you just uh, continue with the concluding remark. Indeed, okay, indeed, uh, having oh, sorry, healthy diet may you live in more positive way with your happy family. Remember when you use the concluding remark, you don't need to elaborate because you just take from the speech on it because concluding remark is actually the last, the last, last sentence in your uh, speech. Okay, so just um, make it, uh, make it uh, short and concise. Yeah, uh, something meaningful that maybe the audience uh, can feel, you know, what you want to try to say and the message you want to uh, convey in your uh, speech. Okay, I think that's it. Okay. Again, uh, you if you want to transform the speech outline to speech tag, remember to refer to the speech outline as a guide 
and you have to elaborate it, especially in content. OK, for introduction and uh, for version, you just copy and paste. For uh, content, you have to elaborate by uh, using example and uh, maybe you can use a citation uh, to elaborate and explain each sub point. OK, I think that's it uh, from uh, today pre-recorded. If you have a question, please do ask me about it. OK, thank you. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.